Many times we use the power of I am against us. We don't realize how it's affecting our future. Here's the principle. What follows the I am will always come looking for you. When you say, I am so clumsy, clumsiness comes looking for you. I am so old, wrinkles come looking for you. I am so overweight, calories come looking for you. It's just like you're inviting them. Whatever you follow the I am with, you're handing it an invitation, opening the door, giving it permission to be in your life. Now, the good news is you get to choose what follows the I am. When you go through the day saying, I am blessed, blessings come looking for you. I am talented, talent comes looking for you. You may not feel up to par, but when you say, I am healthy, health starts heading your way. I am strong, strength starts tracking you down. You're inviting that into your life. That's why you have to be careful what follows the I am. Don't ever say, I am so unlucky. I never get any good breaks. You're inviting disappointments. I am so broke. I am so in debt. You are inviting struggle. You're inviting lack. You need to send out some new invitations. Get up in the morning and invite good things into your life. I am blessed. I am strong. I am talented. I am disciplined, I am focused, I am prosperous. When you talk like that, talent gets summoned by Almighty God. Go find that person. Health, strength, abundance, discipline starts heading your way. But how many people, when they wake up in the morning, look in the mirror, the first thing they say, I am so old, I am so wrinkled, I am so worn out. You are inviting oldness. You're inviting fatigue. Do us all a favor, stop inviting that. When you get up in the morning, look in the mirror, instead of complaining, you should be saying, I am fearfully and wonderfully made. I am attractive. I am getting younger. You talk like that and God will renew your youth. I know people, the older they get, the more attractive they are. A lot has to do with our attitude. The other day, our daughter Alexandra had a copy of my first book from 2004 and she was comparing the picture to my new book that was just released. She said, Daddy, you look better now than you did back then. I said, what would you like me to buy you? I was with my college roommate last week. He said, Joel, what are you doing? You're getting taller, you're growing. I said, I received that. And I didn't want to tell him that he's getting shorter. <laughs> but when you go around saying, I am being renewed in my youth, I am full of health, vitality, wholeness, that's one of the best anti-aging treatments you could ever take. 